Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's another cash stuffing video, and like I promised, we're at a new angle. If you like this angle, please comment down below and let me know. Anyway, so I'm about to get started. Um, just to answer a couple questions that people inbox me, I do what's called a zero-based budget, meaning every bit of my check is accounted for um, so that I know exactly where all of my money is going. Um, this is my entire check minus what I already put into tides and offering because I took that out first before even filming this video. Okay, um, let's go ahead and get started. So this first envelope is going to be for Spotify and Hulu, which is a total of $5.35. So I'm just going to put $6 in this envelope. The reason there's nothing written on it is because... Um, soon I'm going to be having a whole, um, I'm going to have different pretty envelopes. So I didn't want to waste time making it when I'm just going to change it in a couple weeks anyway. Um, next up is gifts and gifts is going to get $40. Um, gifts already has uh, 60. So now there's, that takes it to a total of 100. Okay, next up is law school. Now this money that I'm saving for law school isn't actually for law school itself. It's for my applications for law school. I figured I should probably clarify that because at this rate, I'll never be able to pay for it. But there's already $40 in here. So we're just gonna add another 50, bringing our total to um, $90, sorry. <clears throat> um. Next up is Crime Con, my convention. There is, how much is in here right now? We have $60 and we're gonna add 20 more. So now there's $100 in there for Crime Con. Um, next up is car maintenance and Car maintenance has 60, and we're going to add um, 150 more because my insurance and registration is all due this month. So that's why I had to up the amount that I was going to put in there. Um, next is my, whoops. Next is car payment. Uh, my car payment gets $167. It's empty because I just made it. So $150, So um, this is just half my car payment because even though I get paid three times, I'm still just going to do my bills in half. Um, next is my phone, which was just paid, so it is empty, and it's going to get the first half, which is $20. Um, then comes food, which is actually my spending envelope, which has $20 left over, and because I work some overtime, I'm giving myself an extra $10 this time, so I'm actually going to put... 50 in here. That way I can get my nails done. Um, next up is gas. And gas also has $20 left over. So we are adding still our regular um, $80 for gas. Because I drive a lot. So two, four, six, eight. Oops gonna go in here my gas envelope is really beat up because I use it the most um, next is my Bank of America which has a hundred dollars in it right now which I am taking to the bank tomorrow because the bill is gonna be due 
Um, so we're going to start on the next month, which is going to be $50. Um, then comes Chase. Chase has 40 Hmm. Did I pay Chase this month? Oh, oh, of course I did. Yeah, I paid it a long time ago. What am I talking about? Um, and Chase gets another $40. Because 80 is what I paid. I don't know why I thought 40 was what I paid. And then comes American Express, which I'm so excited about because it is going to be getting paid off. So we are adding 337 to American Express. One, two, three, 20, 35, 36, 37. So we have a grand total of, Okay. All right. I probably should have did this the other way, but whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two, four, six, eight, ten, sixty, seventy, five, seventy, six, seventy, seven. One thousand one hundred and seventy seven. That's more than what my bill is. Did I count that right? Hold on, let me double check. Okay, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 1,000, 20, 40, Oh, no, 50, 55, 56, 57. Okay, that's right. Yep, so that money is going, and American Express will be paid off. So we will no longer have an American Express envelope, and the next one we're going to be snowballing is Chase. All right, guys, that concludes this week's cash stuffing video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below or you can inbox me. I'm happy to explain anything that I'm doing or helping you get started with your own debt-free journey. Anyway, that's it. See you guys next time. Bye!